Hey guys, I'm LB, and let's check out Pneumatic Rotation by Flooper. Don't look at the update notes. Alright, well, I don't normally look at the change notes, but I totally could if I wanted to. But let's not. Let's get going. We have a flip panel, and a portal surface there, probably for the funnel. See. We have a platform, which is already powered. Awesome. This button disables that fizzler. And I'm assuming this button with no signage probably goes to this dropper with no signage, right? That's my assumption, and that assumption seems to hold true. Awesome. And we can't really put this cube anywhere else but on this button for now. There's also that over there, and I'm guessing we'll want the funnel to push the cube over there. There's also a button there, for a light bridge. I'm guessing that's only if you get trapped, though it seems to be permanent. Of course, if you actually went there yourself... And I'm assuming that light bridge is also connected to the button like that. Yeah, I'm assuming that's just anti-trapping situation right there, so I don't think we ever need to actually press that button. Okay, now... what about in here? Okay, that drops a laser cube, which will not auto-respawn. Alright. That's a good question, does that cube auto-respawn? Oh, this does the funnel. There's no portal surfaces in here, though, right? Yeah, there's- there's no portal surfaces in here. I'm not sure how we're gonna get the cube in here. Alright, so this is cube auto-respawn. It does not. Interesting. There we go. Put this back where it goes. So let's think about this, some. Um, what activates the flip panel? Something in that other room there. The funnel is activated by that button. We can't get the cube on the button. There's also... I'm guessing this is for a laser? Yeah, yeah, the laser cube's gonna go over there. We're gonna have the laser come out of here to the laser cube and into the receiver there. What activates the laser, though? This light bridge. What is it for? Probably just so we can't get into this room. Fair enough. Oh wait, but then... No, we need to get the laser cube out, so this has to be... ...done with that. Uh, ooh, hmm, what? No, no, yeah, cuz- okay, yeah. <laughs> for some reason I thought that if we moved the funnel here, it wouldn't be there anymore, but no, that's the funnel origin, so it would always be there. Uh, what does this sizzler... This sizzler is also done by this button, alright. Oh wait, we can actually just do this right now. I didn't even realize that. Alright, well. Save, and... Continue. There we go. That's how you do it. Ah, <laughs> And that's why you save before you continue. <laughs> yeah, I should have gotten off the button a bit earlier, but I wanted to wait till I actually saw the cube. Let's see... Continue. There we go. There we go. We have our laser cube. We can go ahead and, I don't know, maybe put it here-ish, per se? Perchance, perhaps, come to me, cube, and we're gonna put this guy on this button. Alright, now we can save again. I think we are pretty much good to go. Yeah, we can get over here now and see what's up. And see what's what. Ah, yes, I see. So this button activates the laser. There we go. Oh, we do need to press that button to get back. Alright. Yeah, cause how else would you get back? Yeah. Alright, I was wrong about my earlier assumption. This is not simply anti-trapping, this is actually necessary. Now we can head back. It could just be on from the very beginning, but huh, whatever. It doesn't really make that much of a difference, to be honest. So now... We just need to do the final step. In hopes that the laser cube did not 
tilt at some weird angle like that or whatever. I heard the exit. Where is the exit, though? Is the exit up there? No. Am I going crazy? I don't think- Oh, it's right there. Ha <laughs> Right by the entrance. Alright. Okay. I guess that was an okay puzzle. Pretty simple, but it was good. Well guys, as always, thank you for watching, I really appreciate it, and I will see you all in another video. Goodbye!